Hi there, welcome to this week's edition of the TCM Import. I'm Ben Mankiewicz. Tonight, from Italian director Lucino Visconti in 1957, it's La Notte Bianchi, or White Nights. Visconti was one of the founding members of the Italian neorealist movement, consisting of films made after the Second World War, movies telling real stories shot on real locations and real environments, often with real people, non-professional actors. But by this time, the late 1950s, Visconti was expanding his repertoire and experimenting with other techniques. In this case, that meant shooting not in real locations, but on studio sets, and it meant telling a story that involved dreams and fantasies. The script comes from a short story by Dostoevsky, published in 1848. It centers around a lonely young man who meets a lonely woman. Sounds perfect, right? Well, maybe not. Turns out she's lonely because she's in love with another man who may or may not be coming back to her. But either way, he continues to occupy her thoughts to the exclusion of any possible relationship. Visconti updated that story, changing the setting from 19th century Russia to present-day Italy. Then he assembled a terrific cast, including Marcello Mastroianni, who was well on his way to becoming one of the biggest stars in Italy, as well as Austrian-born actress Maria Schell, Maximilian Schell's sister, and the great French actor Jean Marais. From director Lucino Visconti in 1957, here is this week's TCM import, the TCM premiere of Le Notte Bianchi. <laughs> 